many of us in the Great Plains Conference are celebrating the Kansas City victory of Philadelphia in a thrilling Super Bowl. In fact, as we're recording this video, people in the streets of Kansas City are lively celebrating with fervor the winning of their beloved team. But the real victors from Super Bowl 57 are the people in need of food and the agencies that support them. United Methodist in Kansas, Nebraska, Missouri entered into a friendly competition with our fellow United Methodists in the Greater New Jersey and Eastern Pennsylvania conferences. Both conferences challenged each other to see who could bring in more food donations for pantries and on mission fields. The Episcopal leader there, Bishop John Scholl, has generously conceded, even appearing in a video earlier this week wearing a Patrick Mahomes jersey. I have to say, Bishop Scholl, you look pretty good in red and white. And our cabinet looks forward to receiving those Philly cheesecakes and tasty cakes. And as proud as we are of the Kansas City victory, we're even prouder of the witness of Christ presented by all of you who donated food to help those in need. Congregations large and small, urban and rural from Kansas and Nebraska rallied to the cause. You know, Jesus said in Matthew 26, 11, we will always have the poor with us. And that's a humbling thought. It's a justice issue that deserves our ongoing attention. But it's comforting to know that the people of the Great Plains, the Missouri, the Greater New Jersey and the Eastern Pennsylvania conferences are ready and willing to help tackle the problem of hunger. Perhaps this will kick off a new tradition for us in the Great Plains. We expect Kansas City to be participating each year, but even if they aren't in the big game, a food drive around the Super Bowl, one that we can plan on each year, seems like a worthwhile service project for our entire conference. So congratulations to Patrick Mahomes, Travis Kelsey and the entire team, and thank you to all who donated food. Your heart for mission and for the people and communities around our two states warms my heart as your bishop. Thank you to United Methodist in the Philadelphia area for having some fun with us. We ask God's blessing on them, on us, and especially on the poor as we continue to strive to love one another in the name of the risen Christ.